This short video is going to walk you through how to uh, take a test. You'll notice that in the Moodle course we have a uh, practice test added and I'm going to go ahead and take that test. So I click on practice test. It's going to tell me how many times I've attempted it, how many times I've completed it, and what my grade is. Uh, it's because I've attempted this before. So I'm going to click continue last attempt. I didn't do anything with it. And you'll notice that I've got five questions here. And I scroll down and I can see all five questions. So all the questions should show up the moment you start your, your test. You'll also notice that each question uh, has a submit button below it. This is a way that you could submit as you go so that if there is a problem along the way, you don't lose the information that you've already done. So I would recommend that you take the test that way. Um, if you like to live on the wild side, uh, there are three buttons on the bottom here. You can save without submitting. This will allow you to come back and finish at another time. Uh, you can go ahead and submit the page. Uh, this will go ahead and submit everything, but uh, won't close this screen out. And then submit all and finish what is actually the one that is going to complete the entire piece. So I, uh, again, recommend that you submit your answers as you go, and then when you're all done, you're going to go ahead and submit all and finish. So here we go. I'm going to take this test. Uh, Bill Gates founded which company? Apple, of course. All right, so we'll just answer that, and I'll say submit, and it's going to, oh my gosh, I got it wrong. All right, well, let's try to see if I do a little bit better on the next one. What is the capital of Texas? Well, we, we know that to be Austin, so let's see if I uh, got that one right. Um, well, it looks like I, I do know a little bit about Texas. What about the American flag? Uh, white, maroon, and blue. There we go. Let's, let's do that, and I'll submit that, and... Oh my, let's see. Uh, it doesn't like maroon, so it must not be an Aggie, uh, uh, an Aggie flag there. Uh, DHMO, dihydrogen monoxide, can be found in cancer cells. What is DHMO? Oh, if it's found in cancer cells, it must be, uh, must be a carcinogen. So we'll go ahead and submit that. And it uh, uh, looks like I'm not doing so well. I mean, hopefully you'll do a little bit better. And the reason for seasons, summer, fall, winter, and spring... Uh, must be, oh, let's see, fluctuations in atmospheric carbon related to global warming. So we'll, uh, we'll select that. That's kind of a, a vogue thing at this time. And let's see how we did. Uh, oh, not bad at all. Uh, I mean, horrible, horrible. Um, well, let's go ahead and submit all and finish. And you'll notice that at that point it gives me a, uh, a message that says that uh, uh, once I close this, I will we'll not be able to change my answers. Um, when you submit, you're actually able to, uh, to change your answers to submit the page. But once you submit all and finish, you're not able to come back to that attempt and make any changes. So here we go. There's my practice attempt one. Tells me that I got one out of five. That's uh, not very good. So hopefully you'll do a little better. Um, if you have any difficulties with this, go ahead and post your uh, your questions to the uh, forum, uh, and uh, we will uh, get to those quickly. Thank you.